think I might just grab something. Very impressive. There's nothing we can do about it here. He needs to go to theatre. We're going to take a few x-rays, OK? We'll keep you as comfortable as possible until the surgeons are free. You shot yourself? Yeah. How? With a crossbow. Can you show us? Well, I was pulling it back, the, uh, the, the string, and it slipped. And where was your leg? The other side of the room? <laughs> no. No, it, it was... I was... Well, no, no one else was there. D they weren't. No. I honest. OK. I won't say anything. I don't know that. Right, remember, same as when I had appendicitis, yeah? No, other side. What is Big Mac up to? It's been very mysterious today. No. He's planning something for tonight. Uh-oh. Yeah. Is that them? Big Mac, can you do me a favour, sweetheart? Could you keep an eye on a couple of people for me? Yeah. That's Meg's check x-ray. Nice. Looks like it's all in place. I'm going to inform my patient. So, I hope he's coming to the Christmas party. Uh, wake up. Yes, mate. Uh, yeah, it's my brother. We were laying a carpet and suddenly he doubles over. He's got this pain here. OK, let me take some details. Have you been here before? Uh, no, no, never. We're uh, new to the area. OK, name and address then, please. Yeah, it's 58, Alma Road. Age 17, mm -hmm. 4BJ. Sorry to bother you, but um, I was just wondering if I could have a word with them. Um, I think she's called Tess. I'll see if I can find her. Thanks. I think he's hungry. Do you need any help? Um, no. I'm OK. You sure? OK, well, I'll tell you what. Why don't I help you set up? Thank you. You are very welcome. The doctor said something about Amy's sodium levels, that yeah. it might be dietary. Yeah, it's a tiny, tiny bit high, but nothing to worry about. I know, but I've, um, I've brought in the meals that Meg had in her fridge. I was just wondering if there was any possibility that you could check. Sorry, but we really don't have any facilities for testing food. Oh, no, no, I mean, I mean just have a look or, or, or taste, even, to see if they're OK before we give them to her. It, it's, it's just, it's, it's chaos. In that house, there's, there's, there's parties, there's doors are left unlocked, and, and Amy's meals are not being properly monitored, and, and, and who knows what Meg has added to them. It's, it's just, I've, I've been so worried, and, and if I try and make a fuss, nobody listens to me. Um, OK, just give me a minute. Oh, thank you. I'll, 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 I'll just be in reception. Everything all right? Yeah, I have no idea how invasive unwelcome affection could be. I know you've noticed, Sam. Everywhere I look, she's... she's... That thing with Darvilla? I was taking it to an extreme. Oh, don't worry. Don't worry. No, what? Please, no. please, tell Forget me. Forget about it. It's fine. You coming to the Christmas party? Are you joking? No, no, no. What else could possibly... No, 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 no. Trouble? Oh, he just loves parties. <laughs> Don't worry. He won't be coming tonight. All right. I think you're set up. I'll leave you to it. Hungry girl? Who's the hungry girl? One for Mummy. Ooh, yuck. <laughs> That's better. Chocolate. 
my little hide. Mm. Nearly been an hour. I think we should just go. If you think people are going to want someone with a record for GBH fitting their carpet, then fine, off you go. Look, as soon as we get a chance to see if I can find him, okay? Have you heard anything those two been saying? Who? The two behind me. It's just that uh, Jeff and Dixie think they might have something to do with this um, uh, cross ball thing. Yeah? Well, I think one of them's trying to fake an appendicitis, if that's any help. I hope you're going to thoroughly disgrace yourself tonight. Big Mac Noll says he is. Did I? Oh, well, I might have a few uh, little tricks up the old sleeve. This party's going to be so dull. Oh, don't be such a party pooper, man. You know, it'll be... Uh, it'll be... <laughs> What's happened? Get someone's own. Thank you. Oh, come on, let's go. Come on. Oh, sorry, back. She's gone all floppy. What happened? I don't know. She just appeared with her. Can you tell me what happened? Meg? <laughs> she did away me. We had all floppy. Before that, did she cry or make any noise? Did you give her anything? I don't want to make any respiratory effort. I think she's going to arrest. I think I can hear a stride off. Meatball. Hey, fellas. How's it going? Oh, Min. Hey, don't worry. They still think I did it. <laughs> okay, stand by to intubate. Yeah. Let's hold off on the tube for a sec. Has a tracheal FB definitely been excluded? No. Well, well, because she said that... Meg, listen, did she have anything to eat at all? She was hungry. OK, what did she have? Chocolate mousse. Don't oh. chocolate mousse. It's all right. <laughs> OK. Are you sure, Meg? Is that all she had? She didn't have anything to chew. She only had a pudding. <laughs> OK, I think I found some kind of chocolate button. Let's crash call the peas and Easter tits straight away, yeah? Fletch, could you? Yeah, listen, mate, why don't we go outside? We're just going to be in the way in here. Come on. Oh, it's well and truly lodged. <laughs> ah! Nice one. That was a good call. <laughs> OK, sure. Well done, right, let's get the EMT team down here to make sure there's no damage. Tess, can you let the family know that she's OK? Um, Zoe, do you mind if we have a word? Yeah, of course. Uh, earlier, with the gran. Uh, sorry for trouble your toes. I was oh. a bit clumsy of me. No problem. I think what you just did there more than wiped the sleigh clean. <laughs> Thanks. Hey, look, um, have you seen those books that were sitting there? No, not recently, no. It appears that Meg fed something to Amy, a hard, round piece of chocolate that got lodged in her windpipe. Hopefully there's little damage, uh, but I think it's safe to say that Amy will be kept in for a few days. Also, I think social services will want to review the level of care and support that Amy's getting. Whether, as you pointed out, even with the best will in the world, Meg can manage. Is there anything I can get you? No. Thank you. Okay. Well, Meg's in the relatives' room. <laughs> no. 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 Meg, no. please, just listen to me, all right? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, I'm just not getting anywhere. Meg, your mum's here. Meg. She doesn't think that she can look after Amy anymore. She wants you to take her. Me? She's just worried that... Well... I fed her! I fed her! Nobody is blaming you, Meg. She nearly died. Mum, please. Meg, Amy's going to stay here for a couple of days. 
And that will give everyone a chance to sit down and work out what's best. Please, Mum, will you take her? Please. <laughs> you can just say he wants to keep it as a souvenir. Hey, that's a great idea. I could stick it on the wall. I'm sure they'd give it to him. And if they don't? Please see it. I know exactly where it came from. Yeah, so? <gasps> so how many crossbows and bolts like that do you think I've gone missing in the last couple of days? Missing? It's nicked, you morons. So's the rest of that stuff. Nicked? What, all of it? Look, just get out and see if anyone's come and gone. Security. What? Stop him. What, how? I don't know. Just get out and stop him. Ah, excuse me. Yeah? What's going on? Nothing. Just close your eyes a sec, yeah? Who's the other one? What other one? What's happening? Can I get some pads in here, please? I'm on it. Try and keep still for me. Why? You could help. Oh, thanks, Dylan. You're a star. 